Good morning, good morning everyone. We will spend some morning together, crafting together, maybe afternoon, depends where you in Australia, Europe, maybe USA. Um, welcome everyone in my YouTube channel. I'm delighted to welcome you and to spend some time with you. We will do some mixed media Christmas cards today. I know it sounds so scary for many of you. I know you are terrified on the thought of creating a mixed media card. A mixed media Christmas card, that's even worse. But I promise you to show you that this is not a brainer, this is not difficult and you have everything that you need to create a beautiful mixed media Christmas card. And I explain to you things. So what do I have here? I have gorgeous leftover papers from Christmas collection, Frosty Morning from a Polish brand, actually beautiful. I have recorded a different video using those papers. It's not on the channel yet. <laughs> I'm recording ahead a little bit, but those are leftovers. And I have some gorgeous, as you can tell, images, wintery, Christmassy images from a brand called Studio Light. I absolutely love, love, love them. Mm, which is my favorite, all of them, to be honest. I have last year as well. Those are from last year. Have a look. And those are so pretty, so stunning as well. Um, I'm going to definitely concentrate on Im picking some beautiful image, my um, focal point, let's say. And some gorgeous colors. I think I'm going to go for those sort of tones, which they actually work perfectly, as you can tell. So what? where do we start with mixed media? card. How do we start? Well, gather some um, products, things that you like in the same color scheme. Let's say I'm deciding for a blues, browns, beige tones, maybe grayish, but basically in this in this moment, creamy, blues, um, this kind of white as well. Of course, there's always a place for a white. And I'm thinking um, that I, I like the most this those images, maybe maybe this one I like, maybe this one as well, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, what about maybe this one as well, okay, I'm gonna put those away, I'm trying to be now better in terms of <laughs> while I clean, why I, why I will be crafting, I will try to make a clean desk as well, and I have a gorgeous beautiful paper from Studio Light as well, let me show you, it's called Studio Light, oh, sorry, phone call, <laughs> I'm back. I'm not too sure where I stopped. Anyway, I have this gorgeous beautiful paper from Studio Light as well. I thought I absolutely adore, adore, adore. So I got just a page. Um, so I'm going to start off by choosing as well a size of my cards. Now, that's another interesting subject that you have been asking me oops, many, many times. What size I use? I used for the past months, years actually, if you've been watching my videos, always this size, 6x6. Six six. Why? I don't know. I just like the how big it is. But recently I'm turning into smaller sizes again, which is slightly smaller than that. And it's, I think, 5x5 five five or something like that. Whichever size works best for you guys. It doesn't matter whether you mix media uh, card maker or you're going to make a stamping card. Size does not matter. This is just what it's in the shop. This is why I like it because I'm just used to it. I may go for it this time again, but it doesn't matter. So I know I'm chatting a lot today, but I wish you to understand the process behind it because so many of you is asking me in my eyes simple questions, in your eyes quite difficult and interesting ones. So I hope that this video will be very ins informative in those terms. So I'm choosing my size of the card. Go for the card you have at home. Do not think that the size I'm using, it's the only size, it's the best size. No. Some people like work on the big surface because 6x6 six six is pretty big. Some people prefer rectangular shape, so it's really personal choice. So I'm gonna make a few backgrounds, as in cut this paper into 6x6 six six size and go back, to come back to you. <laughs> So I do have several backgrounds, 6x6, six six, uh, as you can see, here they are. I'm going to move my papers away, trying to keep it focused and focal, <laughs> so I know where we are. And I have also a few elements of a different sizes, so they're not exactly 6x6, six six, but just a rough, uh, pa it's just some sort of papers of a different sort of sizes. Uh, I'm going to grab my 
I'm gonna work simultaneously. Uh, I hope to make maybe three cards to today uh, in a similar way, but hopefully to co have it different. <laughs> similar but different. So this is not so straight, which annoys me, as you know. Okay, it's straight. And I'm gonna take a third one in white. Let me just grab that quickly. Okay, so I have them in brown and white. Do I have cream? I do have, no, I don't. It would be nice if I would, but I do. Oh no, wait, we're gonna do it. We're gonna swap the idea. So I have six by six white. I have smaller, which is, I don't know, I'm gonna tell you now because yeah, five by five, obviously. <laughs> five by five, six by six. So, so we have that, and I'm gonna work with. I'm gonna work in them simultaneously. So when you think about mixed media, what do you really, really think? Do you think that it's what? Think about it in your head now. When I'm attaching my background, <laughs> I'm using double-sided tape as usual, uh, so it's just faster, easier, nicer more convenient for me and it just it does make a difference when I'm thinking about how even my inside is I like that I don't like glue being sticking out so when you think mixed media I, 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 I believe that you think um, no I don't know what you think <laughs> But when I think mixed media, I'm thinking media, which means use a lot of mediums, all sorts of mediums, and that's it. Mixed media in general is when you have more than one mediums used. People interpret this idea in such a many different ways, because even stamping card is already mixed media in that term. So, but when I'm thinking a mixed media Christmas card, let's say, I think layers, many mediums, different sort of mediums, from watercolors to maybe sprays to maybe modeling paste to this to that. So this is my way of thinking. Again, people have different opinions about mixed media, but definitely card where is no medium used as in just paper scrapbooking it's a scrapbooking then scrapbooking card or project when you start using medium obviously not glue okay <laughs> when you start using mediums sprays and maybe modeling paste maybe some sort of waxes or um i don't know you tell me <laughs> then you're talking about mixed media but definitely by looking at the project you should be able to tell oh there's lots of mixed me mediums used that kind of way you know that kind of idea so I hope that this video will show you different I don't know I <laughs> you know me I didn't plan what I'm, I'm gonna do I'm changing my mind while talking to you while being here at this desk so we can come up with something totally strange today I have no idea but I hope to show you things slightly different maybe show you three different aspects the video will be long but this is hopefully this will be what you've been waiting for this is too big and this is the, the same as this so I'm because I didn't plan for a smaller card so I'm gonna make that smaller give me two seconds <coughs> too big too big too big because I don't look at my measurements oftentimes okay I like that. Now, what are the trick trips tricks that you can do when you think about mixed media? You can what can you do with the paper? For example, I'm going to show you that you can use uh, a tool like that and you can make your paper to look already different by um by what? What you call that? <clears throat> by by uh, distressing. Yes, thank you. I'm sure you knew it. <laughs> distressing so I'm gonna show you that in two seconds let me just make the background again now you don't have to work together with me in the three cards straight away but I think it will be just for me easier to do it since I have I don't know I just think it's gonna be easier for me now I'm gonna use probably some um, chipboards as well I will use probably some uh, lace I also have a doily I'm sure you have doily at home so this is what I'm gonna be using now this is the moment when I'm thinking okay I have two two bases so the moment is for drinking a sip of coffee a bite of my breakfast you know what that is those are scones the most often um, 
eaten breakfast on earth, I think outside of Irish breakfast. In a sweet way it's scones. Scones with marmalade or jam or none <laughs> in Ireland. So I'm in that matter. I love Irish Irish scones and you have been asking me what sort of cravings I have since I'm pregnant. <laughs> This is it, sweet. <laughs> okay, now I'm thinking of building some bit of um, maybe 3D elements on it using my papers. I also have to grab my 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 gesso or my modeling paste, and I'm thinking to do. I think some stars here with my modeling paste. Let me grab my stencil. I do have this gorgeous stencil. I have no idea the brand. Look, it came that like that. Oh wait, it's called Joy. Joy, wait. Joy. Oh my crafts. Joy crafts. A, a bigger writing and more visible would make would would help. <laughs> but it's gorgeous stencil. It's a new stencil. I got it. Uh, I was just shopping recently because I felt that I, I still couldn't find my things from last year. So yeah, okay, I'm gonna grab my white modeling paste and I will add some stenciling here. So this will be, so this is, this has paper, this will have some stenciling to start off. I love that. Well, for now, anyway. Let's see how this is. Oh my, this is gorgeous. Gorgeous. <laughs> gorgeous. Gorgeous. And I. Uh, no, well, I had. Oh, no, no. But um, before this will dry, I'm gonna quickly be quick as this um, bird. Beep beep. <clears throat> you know, what's that bird? You know the bird. <laughs> But before this dries, I'm going to grab my glitter and I will sprinkle sprinkle on top of my beautiful stenciled snowflakes. Absolutely gorgeous. So I'm going to leave that for two seconds, literally, or maybe ten seconds and move that on the side just for now to think for what could I do in here to make it a little bit different I don't know I don't know you tell me oh maybe this or maybe this okay I like that now this is quite delicate paper which hmm, doesn't make easy uh, to to work with the tool but that's okay it's easier to do sides distressed this, this sides when the thicker paper but that's okay so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just concentrate on making my this should be a little smaller but it doesn't have to be a little small it can it doesn't have to so what I'm gonna do is to make my life easier I'm gonna just do this and I'm gonna do this mm-hmm and I will distress the other ends, the other sides of my card and I maybe like that to be there, picking element and please have a look, I'm not really precise here no, I am not at all okay, this is what we have for now, at least um, you could use double sided tape or 3D foam I'm going to stick with the tape again <clears throat> because I don't need this to be raised yet. Some other elements maybe. Next layer. But this I'm happy to have as it is. So I am just... It doesn't have to be even so I don't mind whether I'm going to stick it here or there or there. Um, just a rough idea where this could be. Maybe on the side more. That's nice. That's nice. Now. I will probably add something here, so something will be nicely picking through. And I also think time for some stenciling again. And I have a different stencil this time. Let me show you. Dutch Dubadu. Du <laughs> I love how pretty and small that is. So I'm gonna just. 
I never use them, I just purchased them from my favorite online store in Ireland, it's called Cards and Scraps. They're not only online, they are also mortal shop. I shop with them always. Recently I didn't have time to be honest. I just were doing other things but I love them so I, I did shop a little bit with them. So for Irish people or English they actually do send to England. It's called Cards and Scraps or Cork Art Supplies. You will find them. So this is... Oh! <laughs> this is what we have. And I'm gonna just add here. Now, perfect, beautiful, stunning, loving it, loving it, loving it. Will I also... No, I'm, I'm running to clean, wash them because now I have two stencils that are dirty. Let me give you two sec... Give me two seconds. Before I wash it, of course, nothing will be this, nothing will be gone in the <laughs> in here. So I'm gonna just clean off my stencils because maybe I'll do some something else with it, like journaling page. I don't know, something maybe. So we can just try and add some texture here, <laughs> isn't it? Why not? Why not? I've learned that uh, over your comments as well because oftentimes I wouldn't do it and you'll be like, you could just do this, da da da. <laughs> Off I go to wash. Look at this. How gorgeous, how stunning is this. I love it. I'm gonna leave it for dry naturally. So I'm gonna look at those two first. I'm not adding any uh, glitter here. I wish them to starts to be white as they are. Nothing happening yet here, but relax, we will do something. So I'm gonna leave those here. Mm -hmm. Half of breakfast is gone <laughs> in the meantime. I like to wash my stencils in the sink, especially in the detail is so delicate that rather than using baby wipe because you just don't and do it straight away. You won't destroy your stencil that way. Now I'm gonna put this away a little bit so I have more space here. I hope I hope you don't mind that I'm using, that I'm creating simultaneously two, th two, three, two, three things, but I love running ideas in my head and <laughs> that helps. This is nice, a way of adding texture interest to your pro page, to your project, to your card, and it's cheap, isn't it? It's cheap, which is great, and it's very wintry, very Christmassy. Already pretty? Already pretty. <clears throat> I think I'm pretty much happy with what I see now and we could stick it but I'm gonna add some lace. Let me see. I have this gorgeous lace. It's from it's from my dad I'll show you. It's like this. It's from my dad. My dad sells those things so that's even his <laughs> His writing, that's even his writing. My dad, he puts things on the little cardboard and da da da, whatever. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna use that. I love using things from my parents that they sent over to me because, and this lace is probably like five year old, four year old, like really old. Uh, just because I have many other things, I'm not able to use everything at once. And I love keeping things. <laughs> I'm a hoarder, so. So I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna, Mm. I'm gonna add this lace, I think. Somewhere there. Let me grab some other. Now this is gonna be pretty crazy color of a lace. But, and strange for Christmas. But I think it actually funny enough matches this color. Have a look, guys. Can you tell? A little bit. So it's gonna be a bit pinky. I never ever ever use this lace before. So I think it's awesome to actually finally find some use for it. <laughs> okay, I love that. Something else. Uh, lace number three, I think. <laughs> Maybe like this, kind of creamy goldy something. Okay. I have my hot glue already on, which is awesome. And I've already lost my composition, but that's okay. So what I'm gonna do now is I will I will, I will what? I'm gonna just grab, leave this as it is, cause I love it. Move this on this side. 
and I'm gonna grab my hot glue and I'm just gonna don't be precise of where you're adding the glue because you may work <clears throat> on your card and talking in things here so leave the gap with no glue maybe here concentrate more on the middle part now here is and I want this to be tilt to this to this side this to this side why I don't know <laughs> that's how I like mm. before I'm gonna add this gorgeous lace oh looking great to me and I am um, I need more glue I need more glue. You said you so much enjoyed recent videos in the morning when I had my breakfast here. <laughs> so I thought, okay, Marta, instead of uh, spending morning different, just spend this morning with your best friends on YouTube. So I hope you will like that <laughs> today's idea for a card. Now I absolutely love, adore what I see. This is slightly too big or I don't know what. Oh wait, what about if I'm gonna change my mind and tackle this in there? Yes, but I'm gonna have this. <clears throat> mm -hmm. I'm gonna have this. Look, this doesn't this just stick together without that and that's super. I'm gonna have that. Mm -hmm. I may just leave this. Oh, I love that. And this could be like that. How gorgeous, isn't it? Okay, so we leave those two together, they're best friends, and we are gonna add some glue here. So hopefully this will stick with our gorgeous pinky lace. <clears throat> this is so pretty, so beautiful. I love what I see right now. I have no idea what we should add more. Let me think, let me look around what I have brought here and prepared uh, for it. Mm, I have some out loud process of thinking. I found some beautiful flowers. They're not Christmassy, but they're wintery. They're just matching what I have in my mind here. <laughs> and sometimes don't overthink, don't worry about things not really matching the idea of Christmas as yet. Like those flowers were not designed for Christmas, but that's okay. Maybe we can just uh, make this more magical and make it into Christmas with our elements in a second. So this is what I have right now. I'm thinking we need some shine, we need some glitter, we need some white. I have some 3D snowish kind of thing. We maybe spray something. Mm, I also have bought those gorgeous little flowers which maybe they will be together with them or are we gonna just exchange them and not use the ones that I'm thinking I don't know I don't know I don't know <laughs> but I like what I see I need some chipboard I have some chipboards and those are beautiful lacy kind of uh, chipboards which I think could work gorgeously with my project with my card <clears throat> Now, where is the <laughs> holding part? It's here, and I think it's here. Can you see? You can, okay. <clears throat> so somewhere there, mm -hmm. and maybe more, one more, and here, and there we go. Mm -hmm. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. <clears throat> Those can go on the side. And <clears throat> you see, it's a process of, I didn't plan it, so it's a process of thinking where this could go. I do believe this could be so pretty here. Awesome. And I'm going to do it because it just, it just works for me. So I guess you will agree that it does look nice. And so there we go. I, I will hold it up high a little bit so it's not going to be that flat but just a little raised from the rest. Beautiful. Now <clears throat> I thought of adding one more but maybe it's too much. Maybe this is like enough. I never thought of bringing the camera closer but I don't know. Can you see? Is it? Uh, okay. Should be fine. Uh -huh. And maybe 
maybe this let's see it's gorgeous sorry <laughs> I'm gonna attach it there or not wait what about if we go for the top part no no too much I think I think it's just perfect as it is so I'm gonna leave that for now <clears throat> And instead of the big flowers, why don't I just add the goldy ones? Although I'm missing the, the yeah, although I'm missing the pink pink ad addition here for my or this addition, the kind of pinkish beigeish that could be my big focal point in this way in this matter, like this. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we go. I love that. Now, I love that, and some lovely title could go there. Mm, I will add my little bow. So uh, recently uh, one of you have been asking how I do it. So I do two loops and I'm turning around like that just to hold it a little bit. Then I'm, I'm cutting so it's like a bow without really being... Um, it's just it's turned but I didn't do much there. It's just turned, can you see? And I'm just putting all three to all four elements together, adding a little glue in there. And let's say I wish for it to be, let's say there. I will add more glue here for the flower itself. <clears throat> there we go. Now, so I'm gonna add some flowers first and then I will have a look where can I add the string? Will I add more string? Mm -hmm. Absolutely love this now, guys. Absolutely love this. I love the not so wintery, no, not so Christmassy, but very wintery feel to that card. I absolutely love this. Now, let me see because I think everything is slightly tilted and it's okay not being perfect, but. It has to have some sort of <laughs> look for the eyes. Loving it. So now uh, I'm gonna make one loop. Sorry for the light. I don't know what's going on here. A loop number two. Turn and turn one or two or whichever. It doesn't matter. I'm not. This is not. Uh, this is. This does not hold properly. It's just for me to kind of make my life easier. And I have this. A little bit of glue and somewhere let's say maybe here for the big flower <clears throat> one more maybe you have the brown one I recently had them brown ones in my Etsy store many many of you have bought it so thank you thank you so much white one is ordered my dad made a mistake and instead of ordering the white one he ordered the brown one that's okay <laughs> you can use both uh, so I will have there's something left I think in store of the them strings and the white one will be in a few weeks maybe three weeks four weeks I don't know it will be there eventually <laughs> I will have it eventually so I'm thinking will it mat match it will how gorgeous it is now I love that how pretty delicate so soft we're just missing really some bit of touches of gesso maybe or this thing let's see what's that because I haven't used that I bought it as in 3d something but I don't know oh yeah it's like a, oh it's nice it's 3d 3d something so this could be 3d snow like making mm, no I don't like that so no oh it's uh, it's very sandy actually so this could be probably added like this. Mm. Interesting buy. Interesting buy. Maybe I have to find some some special idea for it. Or maybe I just will have to add it just like that. Without really concentrations on just as a snow effect. If it's a snow effect at all <laughs> or not. Mm, I'm not too sure. I think I prefer the gesso itself. So you can grab the gesso rather than this strange thing. <laughs> and a brush, if I have the brush I do. And just go for... Yeah, I prefer that, sorry. <laughs> I'm old school. 
a little bit of gesso is always good everywhere or somewhere here and there and then so this is kind of your mixed media card since you are using a bit of something or you can just grab the spatula like this grab your gesso or modeling paste <clears throat> do, do you hear I'm rushing in my voice? I think you do because I hear I'm rushing <laughs> I don't know why <laughs> Um, uh, there's not nothing that rush, rushes me, but I feel I'm rushing, rushing. Well, I, I always feel bad when there's the video, it's super long. Then you always say, no, it's not. There's always some word, some someone says, oh, I love your videos, but it's so long. And I'm thinking, yeah, but the beauty of those videos and to learn something really, in fact, is to have it chatty and long. Anyway, this is what we have. I have this. Those are little stars. I wonder if they stick if I'll just attach them like that. That would be awesome. They do stick. <laughs> this is so unprofessional, but that's okay. Look, guys, just go for it. it that, not, that is not professional. It's very messy. But let's be messy. Let's be messy. I have so many of those stars that if some of them won't stick and, and end up on my floor that's okay I love that look oh my no I haven't expect this look gorgeous gorgeous close your oh wait maybe there a little more there is lots of just so so some of my uh, stars end up being white from gesso some of them are not that's okay I may repeat the process just with the glue afterwards. Okay, so this is what we have. Let me clean my my finger. Um, and I think we're nearly ready, we're nearly finished. The only thing is that, what I was thinking is to add a little bit of hmm, spray, but I'm wondering, do I need to add any spray to that? It's gorgeous as it is. Let's see the title. What about this, guys? Have a look. Christmas. Merry Christmas. Uh, I don't know. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. I think I need something else. Something else. Something smaller. Something different. Something more delicate for that. With love. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let me see. I also bought this set, $7.50, I thought it's a pretty good buy when we have so many little uh, titles and that's from Hunky Dory, I never heard about this brand, Hunky Dory, it's Hunky Dory Crafts Limited, Hunky Dory, yeah, it's a UK brand, so awesome, Merry Christmas, Winter Wishes, blah blah, Holy Jolly Magical, wonderful, so many and they're also tiny, which I love. And now when I'm buying, I'm just thinking, how will I really use it? Will I really use it? And, um, well, uh, you know, I'm trying to predict my buys instead of, oh, it's a great price, but oops, I never use it. What's the point? So I'm really careful of what I'm buying. Season's greetings would be nice. I, I don't think this is very Christmassy, so it's a great idea for someone who doesn't really maybe celebrate Christmas that much or something. So... Uh, winter wishes would be I think pretty nice I think so I'm gonna try that winter wishes uh, and I also thought to maybe instead of using white cardstock I could just um, I could just stamp this on some some something like that if it will ma uh, if it will fit <laughs> let's see let's see Mm-hmm. Dum 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 dum. Let's see. No, that's a little too small. Let me find some bigger one. I have it. I have it. I have it. That should be just perfect. Oops. Can you see? You can. <clears throat> I do it again. It's not perfect. It doesn't have to, but it would be nice. <laughs> Isn't it? Oh no, what is wrong with you, Marta? I have to get that stamping stamping uh, machine from Tim Holtz, for sure. This is my next buy. Maybe even today. There we go. 
because I have this gorgeous huge butterfly. Will I show you? I will. And I have I don't have the big block <laughs> to stamp it. Look at this huge butterfly. Woohoo! <laughs> so I need some idea how to actually use it, stamp it and so on. Anyway, Winter Wishes I think looks pretty nice. Let's see, maybe I'm wrong, but I'm not so convinced about the black letters here. No, two seconds. I have some chipboards <clears throat> like this. Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas, let it snow. Happy New Year family Christmas tree, believe. No, 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 two seconds. What about this more delicate writing? Maybe it's just the way that this is made, the writing itself, maybe that's... Oh, let's see. It's just too harsh for me, for some reason. <clears throat> okay, and... Much nicer, I think, much nicer, but also... It would be, I think, nice if we could have a little distress look on that, maybe. Let's see. Oops. Mm -hmm. Oopsie. <laughs> just a little bit. That Just a little bit to give this... So if you cut this not so even like I did, <laughs> <laughs> you can just pretend that's how it's meant to be. I love that. Now I you can t I hope you can tell why I prefer this. Well, you know, it's just yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. Now I need some 3D little foams. If your foam if your foam is like mine a recta a square, you can cut it in half like here and have it smaller. So again, just think what you could do with what you have, okay? Think what you can do with what you have. I like that. Okay, now I am gonna add this here and I will love it <laughs> dearly. No, I like that. I like that, I love it. I think it's so cute, pretty. So delicate, so perfect. And mixed media. In my eyes anyway. <laughs> Time to move on to card number two which is either this card or this card. Um, let's go for this this card. This this one seems to be easier. <laughs> I don't know why. Oops. I don't know why but it seems to be easier for me. Um, what could we do? I think it would be so lovely if we could add some uh, nice, um, what you call this, some nice uh, um, lace here. So what I will do now, I'm gonna cut my lace into smaller <clears throat> and try to tuck it in more in there. Mm-hmm like this awesome looks good and, but if you feel like you wish to tuck it in something else like other maybe some other lace uh, like what hmm, let me see no this is I'm not sure if I go for that color so no I'm gonna make this smaller just a little bit shorter because it doesn't want to tuck in too much so I wish this to stick it stick out a little bit but not too much so mm -hmm. awesome super so I still didn't decide where's my front where's my back <laughs> of the card that's okay and the card itself is not dry yet so yeah that's just me okay I mean those stars, can you tell? Maybe I dry them before I destroy it. <laughs> Maybe that's what I should do. Dry it before making it bad. Now you can, if your lace doesn't have a nice side design, you can just cut it into desired shape like that. And make this, your, make this yours, like here. Talking in number two. There we go. 
and I'm going to add this a little bit. <clears throat> I even like when it's sticking out naturally like this. <clears throat> okay, that's nice. I like that. I like that. I think we could use something else which I have here. It's called cheesecloth, Mus Muslim cloth, Mo cheesecloth. I don't know. Um, again, you will get it in chemist easily. And this is a great, nice way to add some interest to your project and some sort of um, textury 3D feel to your card. Inexpensive again. <laughs> As you know, I like to give you inexpensive ideas, and this is one of them. Another one is <clears throat> tool, tool, tool. It's this thing. So, if you rip it off, it could be even more interesting. So that's that's nice. So I have those two now, and I also wish for some nice paper in the meantime. And this is my, oops, no, I'll dry this first, the little stars, stars are dry, now, oopsie, <laughs> um, I wish my, my, oops, this to be kind of half semi-transparent, so, so my stars are peeking through there, mm-hmm, and, maybe my cheesecloth oopsie now without this will be moving with <laughs> if I want if I want stick it since I dried my stars they don't <laughs> want to stick anything now into anything now I like that I should use this I do love this I think I do oh this is nice what do I have here picking on my table mm-hmm that's so pretty. That's so pretty, isn't it? Now, where is my image? I have forgot about that I supposed to use the image. I found another one which is here. Mm -hmm -hmm. No, not so very much. No. But here they are, the images. Oh, yeah, this will work. <clears throat> Let me see. Well, one or two, or both. I can just open that quickly. Now, either this will work nicely, or, or, or both. I thought about this one, but no. Do you know what? I'm gonna leave this one, or, no, not this one. But what about using two? Oh, two seconds. I have another idea, of course. I have this window from Scrapinets, chipboards. Hmm. This could be pretty cute and pretty. Um, <laughs> I should be using the craft knife, of course. But, where is my craft knife? I see the knife, but where is my other element that I don't see? <laughs> That's okay. Um, craft mat. I don't know where it is. Where it is. That's okay. That's okay. It's peace and quiet in the morning so much. Now I need a coffee. A sip of coffee. <coughs> Nearly gone means I should wrap up the video. <laughs> <laughs> I hope that I'm not too early with my Christmas inspirations but I think I made so little last year and so many of you have been asking for Christmas inspirations that of course they couldn't do different now I will love that so I you know what I'm gonna just attach my image to that straight away and I hope I'm not gonna change my mind <clears throat> because it is pretty as it is. So this is my window with this. How cute is that, isn't it? It is cute, but I also thought... <clears throat> oh, oh, 
this could be used. Mm. This could be nice, could be nice. No. Hmm, super. What about this this thing, this guy, this reindeer? Deer or or whichever. Who are you, mister? No, is it too much? Not so not so sure, not so sure. But I have those <coughs> beautiful flowers here. Let me just show you them. And they are gorgeous indeed for a card. And I also have this thing, which is called Sizzle, which I think could be very nice together. <coughs> so we have some nice, oh my God, the, the dust from the Sizzle that I have. So this is here and here. Most will be covered, unfortunately, I can, I can tell by now. <clears throat> we, I'm trying to add things, but I'm not really, I'm not really worried of, of the outcome. As in, you will see what I mean. I'm just adding now, totally random pieces, and see where this journey will take us. Now I have this lovely cheesecloth, and I hope to change its look. So from being very pretty, <laughs> as in very uh, precise in the look. You can just do this. <clears throat> Sorry for my loud breathing. I'm just heavier and heavier every day. <laughs> so you can imagine it's just harder and harder to not <laughs> loud breathe for me. I love that. I love that guys. It's pretty pretty pretty. So we have a tiny peek of the of the tulle thing and I am tempted to go ahead with the string going like this but no. I don't know. Oh no, please don't move because you are perfect here. You are really perfect here. Trust my judgments. Please, please, please don't move. Don't walk away. I love that. I love that don't change. <clears throat> hmm. I may still do that. <laughs> Hopefully. Okay, so if we go for a look like here and flowers on that side, for some reason, I just feel the heaviness should be there. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that. Okay, go for it, guys. Let's go for it. I'm not just gonna think for double thinking about it. It's beautiful. Now, the huge question, Marta, how are you gonna post this very bulky 3D card? Now, there's few options. Either you find a bigger envelope from a different cards and just have a bigger envelope ready basically. Sorry, I just wish this to be tucking in more for this flower, <clears throat> but maybe not too much actually, because this can be more close. Yeah, so bigger envelope if you find it, basically, that will fit this card. Um, or bubble inside envelope, as in the envelopes with bubbles. Or just the cellophane thing, this kind of thing put it in there and then big envelope like that a 3D envelope as in bubbly envelope so obviously <laughs> the original envelope for this card is not gonna work obviously but that's okay you can just uh, try and use other envelopes or make your own or no envelopes just the cellophane 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 I can't tell the name but this kind of way you know I think it's so cute. It doesn't really match it, but I think it's just so cute. Isn't it? <laughs> I think it is. And I'm gonna just, just have it there. Uh, let me just see. <clears throat> like, I mean, those stars are so cast <laughs> the shape of them. Come on, people, whoever made them, like, really. A shape of star is not that difficult to make. But anyway. <laughs> I think it's quite funny. Okay, what about going? <laughs> no, they don't want to. Go... He doesn't want to go there. But oh, it's nice. It's nice. Okay, it's nice. Let me think. What else can we do? If I eat with you, will I disrespect you? I hope not. Oh, I love this. 
since we have a star here, star maybe here, stars here, gorgeous. Mm, there's no title. <laughs> we might wish to think for a title. That's very little mixed media in this card, isn't it? But you know what? That's okay. Like, I mean, seriously, who would worry? I won't. Okay, I love that. I'm gonna just go for it, guys. Do you know what I love? That I am. We 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 kind of going together with the two cards together, or nearly three cards, and it's hard to make them all three different. But it's possible, as you can tell. So I hope that I'm glad with this kind of. I'm glad that they are different, and I just wanted them to be different. You forgot the first card, so I'll show you how completely different it is. <clears throat> yeah, <laughs> am I right? Now, this cheesecloth is gorgeous here. I absolutely love it, love it, love it. Oh, I forgot about this. That's okay, Marta. Just, just rip it off. There we go. Just rip it off. <laughs> There's no things situations that you that there, it's end you, you can't you have no other options there's always an option there's always a way <laughs> there we go so not too much of that but a little bit I may add more on the next card <laughs> okay go back with the with the flower mm -hmm. and the small one as well oh I love them both. This a bit lower, this like this, this like this, this like that. I so love that. So love that. <clears throat> mm -hmm. It will be there. It has to be somewhere. It's just asking me to be used. That's it. So sorry. You're not in the very colored scheme here, but that's okay. I can forgive you that you're not that perfect. Okay. What else? What else, Marta? Oh, this? <clears throat> Will that be nice? I'm pretty sure I've used that in the recent video that it's not published. But I have used this. So, you will see it in a different video. I'm recording ahead because I'm worried that I may not be able to since uh, I'm growing and growing day by day. And it's harder and harder day by day. I'm just recording for you just in case, just to have something done when I be want when I won't be around. Well I will be around, but not that so much. So <laughs> you know what I mean. Uh, since I love you, since you're my family, my friends and all, I just couldn't dif do different, so yeah. I'm adding this guys, because I think this is already so pretty. I'm not even I'm not even gonna ask you do you like it because I'm sure you will agree with me that this is just so very much perfect to it now it's very 3d very dimensional very 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 something oh so gorgeous now this cheesecloth is sticking out too much a little bit it's like pointless of being there so we have to do something about it and we can either cut it maybe it's just too much oh that's it that's straight away better talking in a little bit and there we go same for here. Maybe tuck it, tuck, it, tuck it in there. I love that. It's so stunning. Even without a title. Do we always need a title? I don't think so. Okay. What about if I take my spatula? Oh, it's here. If I take a little bit of... Oh, I know what I'm gonna do. A spray, a green spray, a turquoise spray like this. <gasps> yes, let me see. I have a little box recently. <laughs> <laughs> that makes my life so much easier, you know, and I can just basically put things inside there, not worry about going everywhere. I have this spray, but spring this there directly, oh, I don't think so. Now I'm going to cover this part, since I don't want this to be too much covered at all. Now I have more paper that I can just go for it like that, a little bit and it's not going to be that that a lot as you think it will be no it's going to be you know it's going to be just 
it's gonna be <laughs> okay to make my life easier and yours as well go for water spray or cream or white or something like this and then instead of spraying directly with this uh, difficult oh maybe no maybe no maybe just go for it Marta okay now you can as you see dilute that quickly a little bit here and there with oh I love that <gasps> two seconds two seconds have a look it's gorgeous you can dilute that even more with if you feel like oh there we go so it's going a little more into places and if you feel it's too dark or something oh there we go can you see how delicate I just made it more delicate with the creamy spray here I love that I'm gonna go for this and you know what I'm gonna do I hope that this is gonna be just so very delicate there we go this is the most crazy <laughs> way of coloring ever but this is it just a touch of uh, that touch of that uh, turquoise I love that there you go you have a mix media card a little more there there we go okay show me that show me that I love that what do you think guys what do you think uh, where's my oh there is there it is I do think we need a little bit of well first of all I'm gonna dry that quickly 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 dry this mm, I do think that we need some some sparkles and I have this uh, glue thing it probably it's blocked so before I even check it I'm gonna grab my oh I'm keep on are you keep on looking for things on your table all the time constantly like this is a killer I swear this is just I don't know how to maybe I need more space of, on the desk maybe I should reconsider my desk space and just get rid of certain things that shouldn't be there because I keep on looking for things and it's so annoying so annoying I'm thinking to go for some glue here and there and there uh -huh. just the edges of my gorgeous flowers same for those little those little those little bulbies things a little bit touches of on the stars on the frame just a little bit nothing too serious I think too serious my friends and I'm gonna sprinkle that with glitter because it's Christmas time well it's not Christmas time yet I just packed the Halloween decorations I have the first time Halloween decorations in my house because I was not working I was not face painting for Halloween as every year I do do you have my head in your camera no <sighs> the battery is doom, 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 so it can disconnect us any second so if it will happen I may have already glitter added to this so sorry for that quickly glitter where are you <clears throat> where are you I need the glitter to be back on to my little jar more and more okay that's enough and I'm gonna grab my card and quickly it was there it was there it was there there and there and there on the star 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 frame frame star and star and I'm gonna come back to you in two seconds change the battery hopefully for this to dry mm. battery is changed and I'm just oh look at that card guys look at this beauty well praise yourself praise yourself if you love things that you've made because it makes our life better and ourselves we deserve to be praised it's gorgeous I hope you can see the shine in the camera we need to finish care number three 
I cannot believe that I actually made a video with three mixed media cards rather than three separate videos. <laughs> but do you know what? I love you too much. Oh, can you see the bellies there, Marta? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, where's number three card? I have some idea for this card and I'll show you why and what I'm thinking. I have this stamp. I didn't use it. Since it's there with this, it could be so pretty. Let me see what I can do with it. Maybe I'm a total uh, wrong person in this here. Now this stamp, it's called Clear Stamp Christmas Shilute Nelle's Choice. <clears throat> yeah, it's Nelle. <laughs> Nelle's Choice. Nelle's Choice. Google it. Nelle's Choice if you wish to see it because I've posted that on my Instagram and so many of you have loved this stamp, and me too, but maybe it's not that gorgeous as we all think. <laughs> Hold your I think my card is full now. The, the battery is, was gone. Um, was I talking at all? Was I recording at all? I think we did record everything that we should, but when I will be editing this video, we will see. But I'm afraid that my card, memory card is... I'm back. <laughs> I really did have to change the uh, clear the clear the clear the what the memory card. Yeah, that's why it was turning off and off and off. But I hope we didn't lose any anything. Um, I forgot that I recorded a short video with Emily yesterday. Well, she was recording herself to be <laughs> to be honest. Uh, okay. Oops. Okay. Now. The platform for easy stamping would be handy here, isn't it? Oh, I love that. Okay, so what can we do with it, guys? I don't know, I don't know, but one idea that I have is this. To just... <clears throat> to just... Mm -hmm, oops, sorry. To just actually do like this. This. And just be more, I don't know, just courageous, just, just, there we go. We have this gorgeous image like that. And, but, 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 and, and, but, and, and, but, I thought to add a little bit of lace and pa more paper. Lace like that. No. I don't like that. No. No, I'm going to change the idea for this card. Mm -hmm. We will do uh, some card idea with them trees, but I don't think it looks good here. Isn't it? It's just, no, this is so pretty and now it's like, like, you know, like, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. I have to think for something else for this card because it's gorgeous as it is. Mm, I have a kit from either last year, I think it's last year Christmas kit collection. I have plenty leftovers. Many of you have been asking me, what do you do with it? Do you use it? Do you throw it? Of course I keep it. And then, <laughs> and then it's nice because I can maybe sometimes use it. So I have those few things now. Um, maybe we just go for a different color. We have some teal on this on this card, some teal, and we have some kind of ish pink, you can tell, uh, here. So maybe this green, another greenish kind of idea will be beautiful, I think. It could be nice. So I'm just gonna go for that. And I also grabbed an old book, an old book like this. I'm not even gonna read what's in, <laughs> what's in there. The mess always after uh, such a busy type of video. It's crazy. Okay, I'm covering unfortunately this. Sorry. I didn't want to, but it just happened itself. <laughs> okay, I like that now. I'm a little bit more calm now because I was like, <gasps> where's this going? I have those lovely seconds, so we may add them. And I have this nice flower flowers and they are funny color I think but they are gonna be perfect well I will make them 
to be perfect here. <laughs> Don't worry about it. In two seconds, in two seconds, I have this gorgeous as well thing. Uh, the dum -da -dum -dum -dum. this is this is making my video much longer when I don't remember the names of those things that's okay and I have them a lovely flowers as well that could match what else what well, mm, um, the good news is the postman just came in and I have back in stock my stickers and my stencils and now because so many of you have been asking me uh, for those I made a special um, listing on my Etsy store for the whole set so nine pieces which is five different stencils and four uh, different stickers for a little better price and better shipping basically so have a look at that I tried my best to make this nicer but I know that some of you already have bits and pieces so what I will do as well I will do separate listing for just stickers and just stencils of course you can buy them separate as well uh, but the best to deal is <laughs> the whole the whole uh, the whole bunch so this is back to store in with other bits and pieces I'm gonna show you what else I'm I'm gonna add uh, surprise surprise let me see um, since it's Christmas coming and you may look for gifts um, pieces that I've made myself as in there were videos or some sometimes they weren't those are notebooks notebook like this will be in the store uh, small notebooks oh sorry <laughs> small notebooks like this I have few left only three left I think that's it and them ones as well so those will be back to not back they will be added to the store I need to make room for new products for new projects basically I'm parting with my things so these are covers that I made with the inside is empty so if you are just looking for something for yourself or a gift or whichever those will be in store so I invite you to Etsy store also the cards that I'm making uh, some of you may some of them may be for sale in the store. There's few other interesting elements there and there will be more coming Yeah, that's it. I'm gonna put that away two seconds. That's enough I don't think you can see much on my table right now since I cannot see much because it's so messy But anyway, we keep on going and finish off this card. I have this interesting element as well This is like five-year-old thing uh, it's just a sort of string. I don't know what's that to be honest, but it is what it is. It's just this <laughs> Find different things in your own home and look for strange interesting things that could match your project. I have a Green tool as well, which I think it's so pretty and that's from that kit from last year I love keeping things from my kit unfortunately or fortunately because I just love it and I love coming back to my old things okay you can barely barely see it here actually barely 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 okay um but I have also no do you know what I'm gonna do I'm gonna place my I can't see myself nearly you see <laughs> I'm gonna place this it's a little too long I'm gonna place this as in in here I'm gonna start gluing things down guys because otherwise we won't see much this as well can go here which is nice and interesting and wait instead of ripping off use your use your punch <coughs> oops I love that. Oops, that's okay. It doesn't have to be perfect. <clears throat> the more queer keen, the better. <clears throat> and like that. I'm going to attach this because I am worried. Oh, and a little bit of this. Because I am worried that if I want, I just won't be able to see anything. Um, oh. So I have to slowly start adding things on that card and go from there because it's it's just different a little bit so which is fine so it's nice to have some sort of look this is so messy table <laughs> that's okay that's okay okay no words down okay I love that no I'm not sure if I should add this or not 
definitely this will be cute but this well maybe look maybe or <clears throat> or you just have to try sometimes you know try this try that and you'll be surprised <laughs> it is nice and it's different and it's good that it's different I'm ripping off my chill again and where's my white chill my it, oh, it's there <clears throat> I'm gonna add more from my one well both are mine <laughs> but this one is from last year kit this one is mine so maybe I will be seeing it more with this one. I don't know, just just an idea. <clears throat> I love that. The little elements that peeking through, not so obvious. Da -da -da, da -da -da. So nice. I like that. I love working in layers. That's probably that's probably the the thing. I do love working in layers. You know what? Since I'm not that convinced, that's okay. You don't have to be convinced with everything about everything. I will simply add uh, glue. We need more glue. I will simply add this here now. This will be such a long video, but I hope you will love it. I hope this will be finding some good explanation of mixed media creations. I do hope very much. And I do hope you will share this video with your friends on your social media. You know why do I ask for it? Basically when you create so many videos and you wish others to see it, um, the best way for others to see it is not that I share it, I share it of course, but it's for you to share it with your friends because if I share it then it's kind of normal thing, I always do it, it's my video. But when others are doing it, it's, it means that the video is nice and interesting and it tells the YouTube itself that YouTube should look at the video and thinking, oh, this is a nice video because so many people suggested this to us. <clears throat> That's how it works, you know. So by you commenting and saying a few words, even thanks for the video, even this. It's already helping a lot because then I can create more and more and yeah that's just how it is. <laughs> I don't really know that much about it but that's how it is. I know that. I, I do know that kind of. Uh, so, oh so pretty. Oh I have the <laughs> things in my food. That's okay. Now, hello pretty pretty. I'm gonna just get rid of that. Oops. That's that's on my table. Don't eat it, Marta. <laughs> don't eat that plastic. No, don't. Okay, I'm gonna just grab that. Glue this down. I don't care. Oh, that's email. Doo -doo -doo. I have so many things to catch up. The Etsy store, emails, messages. If you messaged me, emailed me, oh, I have so much to catch up. I know, and I'm so sorry that I didn't do it yet. But I have been busy with my online class that it's soon hopefully in my Etsy store again. The card making class. It's going to be card making class which is awesome. Last one was a mixed media birdie. This one is just card making no mixed media. Which I'm so happy about because it's going to be completely different and it's going to be budget. It's going to be for you to be able to actually buy it and afford it. Um, and I think a nice way to to buy a pre present for yourself for, for Christmas. That's what I was hoping for, basically. Okay. So I had to catch catch up with that pack those kits. They're not on the website yet, not on the Etsy store yet, but they will be very soon. So I love this. I'm not too sure where I'm going with this card, but I am loving this so far. So good. Maybe it's a little too busy. Um, with this, I'll stick with that. Or what about? Hmm, I don't know. What about? I had this green. Them, them are nice, but no. What about making this white? Where is my? Oh, I have it. I'm gonna emboss that with white embossing powder, and I think it's gonna be so gorgeous. That's what I'm gonna do now. Okay, so time to emboss it. I have very old embossing ink, 
but hopefully this will be enough and it will work will it mm, I don't know is it wet enough I think it is okay I'm gonna be just more less uh, delicate about it <laughs> it's very dirty as you can tell my neighbor just left I see my my um, what's the word my street here <laughs> through my studio window so I can tell that when my when someone is visiting me or when there is the um, oh that's okay when there is a delivery happening or if my neighbors are leaving to go somewhere so it's like spying on people <laughs> okay will this hold or not maybe just partially and that will be absolutely fine that would be fine with me <laughs> Ah, my favorite of all, Lindy's Pure White, Lindy's Stambogank Embossing Powder. Now, I have my tweezers ready here mm -hmm, for a change. I never do, but this time I do. I never do, but this time I do. That makes no sense, Marta. Okay. Da da da! It worked. I'm gonna emboss this. Um, yeah. How? I'm lacking my hands. Okay, I put my embossing powder back on and for those who have no idea about embossing, now we need a heating tool to emboss it properly, very strongly. Okay, so this is embossed and it's gorgeous and it's quite hot so be careful. And I like that, so different, so different actually. Now, before I'm gonna add this, I feel that it would be nice to get my flower being gessoed a lot a lot a lot because it's a little bit too much for me of the color itself so I'm gonna just basically try to um, try to <laughs> uh, get rid of the color a little bit and you can see that it's already nicer and yeah that's what I'm gonna do just a little bit just a little bit. Oops, that's a lot of gesso. Now, if you don't have white gesso, guys, what can you do instead? Think. What can you do instead? You can use some. Um, you can use some acrylic white paint, modeling paste diluted with water, maybe. Have a try. Don't. Don't think that you cannot do things because you don't have what I have. Now I'm gonna just add here my weight just a little bit. Oh and lighten up my gold. Oh that's nice. Can you tell? Can you tell? Can you see? I hope you can actually see what I see. <clears throat> my tulle. I can even add a little bit dry gesso, dry gesso on my tulle so maybe it will be more visible. Okay, before I forget to mention all the links are below the video or Google for Maremi Small Art Etsy. This is where you find my stencils and stickers. So yeah, <clears throat> I know that many of you are actually not so computer aware and I realize that. But I do have to repeat sometimes things two, three times, five times. <laughs> I think it's obvious but not for everyone of course. I think it's time for spring just a little bit so I'm just gonna spray oh I love that super now maybe add a little cream to it I like that I love 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 that I have some other oh, that's too dark I think for my taste anyway for my taste so I'm gonna just dry this oh Everything is falling down, so sorry. <laughs> you have to be careful because things do shrink under your <laughs> heating tool, like tulle will shrink and disappear if you're too close. So be very careful about it. Now, this is what we have right now. So delicate. Mmm, such a nice color. Isn't it? Such a different wintery feel for that. Okay, I love that dearly. I love, love, love it. Um, but, 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 I wouldn't be myself if I wouldn't think, hmm, I wish for something else. And that something else is the touches of gesso here now.
because I wish this to be kind of more of a snowy effect. And this is very hard brush, which helps me to, <clears throat> yeah, helps me to kind of bring out the, the, I don't know, the look of the not so even snow. And you see, I'm not that precise, guys. It doesn't have to be perfect and precise. Trust me. I promise you. Okay. Now, time to add our chippy, chippy chipboard here. Mm -hmm. Somewhere there. Just a little bit. <laughs> because it's a little too long. Okay. Oh, no, that's better. Oh, my team holds scissors and I was just cutting a glue gun. Hot glue. That's okay. <laughs> it's stunning. Oh, my. Okay. Now, do we need a title? Do we need something? I'm sure we need something. But wh what else? Tell me. What else? Mm -mm. I'm thinking, thinking. Let me see. Mm, I looked into my very old stash. <laughs> look what I found. I look what I found. Something like that. Which is pretty cute to me. And this as well. Why not? Um, I like hoarding things. But really I do like using them as well. So if you hoard and buy. That's all so great. Because every year is something different. And you can combine things every year. Uh, but if you do combine and if you do really use them, so that's awesome if you do use them, but yeah <clears throat> Excuse me, okay This is gonna be extremely long video. I hope you're not gonna be bored and halfway down. I hope you will really truly enjoy it Because I love that. Okay, it's all cute and pretty uh, a little bit too long maybe so I'm gonna just Ah, oh, be careful, Marta, not to pinch yourself. Super, okay. This goes there, as it is, because I love it. You see, when I feel for something, I'm just quickly, quickly going for it. Like in this case, now. <clears throat> it's perfect. <clears throat> Excuse me. What about this one? That's okay, that's not too bad there. I think it will just nicely flow in there, nicely being there. <coughs> I have a little angel. It's like so old. <coughs> but maybe I can just add him here somewhere as a fun. And I have a little topper there of a Merry Christmas and a gold for a change. No, no, that's too much. Okay, Marta, you really want it well, but it's okay, it just doesn't go, it doesn't suit. Maybe two more of those down there, somewhere. <laughs> so yes, I always feel the moment of finishing of the video, it's very sad to me, because I don't like saying goodbye to you, and I feel we're nearly there. Uh, so what, what important should I say? If you have any questions, please ask. But maybe you're not the only one having a question. So read the comments. There's always, oftentimes, a question and answer there. So have a look at there. Plus also, some of you are asking me things that are happening in the video, but you too, you have no time or you're too lazy or you just don't care or whichever, whichever. Uh, for uh, the video itself and you ask things that are so obvious and they were told in the video or shown. So please, please do watch the video. <laughs> I, inv I advise you because I won't answer. If things are in the video, I'm not answering oftentimes because it's just too many too many questions I wish to be able to answer but I am not able to so please 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 I'm begging you watch the video and oh that's nice with love watch the video carefully find a bit of time uh, if you found time to ask the question find the time to watch the video as well as I am trying to 
say as much as I can in the video itself. I love when you ask me questions, don't get me wrong, but some people ask me about envelopes or things like how do you post the vi this card now? And I've said about it like half an hour ago, so please <laughs> watch the video, that would be awesome. Now, what about this pretty thing? I hope you don't mind for me to say that, but I do feel that some of you even get frustrated, those who do watch my videos, uh, you do get frustrated by seeing the same old same questions from people and they don't care to read the comments as well, the comment section when there is the answer there already, but some are just, I don't know, I, some people have no time and I totally understand that, but if I need to find time for you to, for answer, to answer you, I don't mind that as long as you find time to read the comments yourself or stuff like that so does it make sense or am I complaining now? I don't want to complain, it's not about this it's just I don't want you to feel that I didn't reply to your comment because I'm happy to reply if... oh I like that <laughs> so cute with the green addition isn't it? not too bad not too bad actually I don't mind, I love answering your comments more than anything, I love reading your comments, but sometimes it's just reading the comment where reading the question is like really like the first five minutes on the video, it's already there answered. Why don't you just watch a little bit, <laughs> please? <laughs> oh, that's that was very complaining, gobble, complaining, gobble. I think I'm gonna finish this card as it is. Oh, title, do we need a title? Like, I mean. There is title, there is none. Let me see. Maybe I just add that gold there. No, I will. Just a little touch. A little gold. With love. Yeah, why not? Down there. But if we have some gold here, what about some gold accent in, in, in like, in like this? This could be nice. <clears throat> oh, there we go beautiful those are ranger liquid pearls I also use Nuvo drops pearl drops no Nuvo crystal drops sorry <laughs> so yes if you're interested because I know you've been asking for that as well okay I'm finishing and I'm sad for that. No, I don't believe it. That it's nearly over of the video. I'm gonna say thank you so much for being here for that long. Because I think the video will be long, am I right? I think it will. But, three completely different cards. Let me show them together. Mm, back to you with my three mixed media cards and clean desk. <clears throat> this will be probably my most favorite. I love the minty color. Uh, I love how mixed up it the card is. I hope you can see the... Oh, 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 let me show you this. Oh, that's much nicer. Uh, I absolutely love, adore this. Uh, very wintry, not so much Christmassy, but I love it. Um, number two card would be this one. I, I think it's so stunning, so cute, so pretty. As you can see, this is my least favorite, but I like this too, don't get me wrong. It's everyone's liking is so different. As you can see, I've used brown cardstock, no problem. I've used white one here, no problem. I've used a different size, uh, a smaller size here. So as you can tell, there is no such a thing as rules in mixed media, in creating mixed media Christmas cards. Don't think that the ways I've showed you is the the only way. No, this is my way. This is how I do it. This is how I'm inspired and this is how I wish for you to be inspired. Uh, layers, bit of gesso, bit of spray, some chipboard, some more paper, some lace, old vintage uh, book, old lace, newer lace, uh, going back to your stash and findings that are forgotten. So yes, I hope <laughs> this video was inspirational and I hope you will create your own. Let me know what you think as always. 
I hope it was a nice time, pretty much, pretty long as far as I'm concerned. Repeat if, and in case someone didn't hear, I'm gonna repeat myself and it's, I'm gonna do a little bit of ad. The, those are my stickers and stencils that I'm using in the videos and I will be using in the future videos. They're back in stock. I made a listing of nine things together, nine set. It's called, I think, Maremi set or Maremi pack, Maremi pack, yeah. <laughs> so you can get all of my little products in one pack for a better price, better shipping price as well. And there'll be a few more bits and pieces. Anyway, enough of chatting, enough of advertising. I don't like that, but um, you've been asking, so yeah, I'm repeating just in case if you're skipping elements of the video and going forward. Um, what I wanted to say, oh, I'm heading off to Lidl just now. Uh, there are some Christmassy stuff in there so I'm gonna grab some for sure and make 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 more a uh, Christmas project I'm gonna grab some of those bulbs not bulbs bulbs bubbles I keep on saying it wrong but I'm gonna make the red 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 whatever you know what I mean <laughs> so look for that um, <laughs> I will post probably my my photos of my findings on the Instagram as always anyway finishing it that for sure giving you so much love and hugs uh, today i hope to start a lovely week a lovely week with me a great morning um yes so thank you so much as always big hugs big kisses plenty inspirations your way let me know what you think please don't forget to share the video with your friends that would be awesome and who is that let's see there we go, that's my Lucas. I'm gonna finish it that, answer his phone call, and I'm gonna say bye and thank you and I love you. Bye, bye bye. <laughs>